what's up guys in this video we will be comparing the cool pad note 5 with xiaomi redmi note 3 li eco le2 and uh, the lenovo k5 note so first talking about the display all the four phones have a 5.5 inch full hd display in terms of processor the cool pad note 5 has qualcomm 64 bit snapdragon 617 octa core which is quite laggy and uh, produces a heat in comparison of Xiaomi Redmi Note 3 which has a 64-bit Snapdragon 650 hexa-core. It has a better performance than Coolpad Note 5. La Eco LE2 has a Qualcomm 64-bit Snapdragon 652 octa-core which is again a good processor and K5 Note has MediaTek 64-bit Helio P10 octa-core. Uh, I actually don't like MediaTek so can't comment on this. Talking about the RAM, Coolpad Note 5 has a 4GB of RAM. On Xiaomi Redmi Note 3, you get two options, 2GB and 3GB as you all know. LE2 has a 3GB RAM and K5 Note has two options, that is 3GB and 4GB. And uh, talking about the storage, on Coolpad Note 5, you will get 32GB plus expandable storage. On Redmi Note 3, you get two options, 16 and 32GB with expandable storage. And on LE2, you get 32GB which cannot be expanded further. And on K5 Note, you get 32GB plus expandable. Talking about the rear camera, on Coolpad Note 5, you get 13 megapixels with LED flash. On Xiaomi Redmi Note 3, you get 16 megapixels with face detection and autofocus with dual focus LED flash. On LE2, you get 13 megapixels with same features like Redmi Note 3. And on K5 Note, you also get 13 megapixels with dual LED flash. So Coolpad Note 5 has a single LED flash and rest have dual LED flash. And on the front you will find 8 megapixel on Coolpad Note 5 and on Redmi Note 3, K5 Note and the LE2 you get 5 megapixel. Battery wise Coolpad Note 5 has a good battery of 4010mAh while on Redmi Note 3 you get 4050mAh which is a little bit better. And on LE2 you get 3000 mAh which is quite low and on K5 Note it's 3500 which is also low in comparison to Coolpad Note 5 and Redmi Note 3. Talking about the OS, Coolpad Note 5 comes with Android 6.0 and uh, Xiaomi Redmi Note 3 has a beta version of 6.0 but stable version is still on 5.1 with MIUI 8 and uh, on LE2 you get a 6.0 marshmallow and same on K5 Note. In terms of price you get uh, the Coolpad Note 5 at 11,000 and the price of Redmi Note 3 is, uh, has dropped by 500 and 1000 so it's available for 9500 and 11000. Same for the LE2 which is uh, again priced at 12,000 and for K5 Note you have to go for 12,000 and 3500. So for according to me I think uh, still the Redmi Note 3 is uh, a winner if you want a better performance. So that's all for this video. If you enjoyed the video please like, comment, subscribe and share. Thank you.